friends, I'm Miss Alyssa. And I'm Miss Chloe. And we are excited you're watching this video. You know, we get a lot of questions about how to read the Bible. What is the Bible? God's Word. And since, you know, we are old and very wise. Only sometimes. We want to share with you some of our tips for reading the Bible. So these are just some suggestions that have helped us in our walks with God. So follow along if you want to learn. Therefore, encourage one another and build each other up, just as in fact you are doing. Encourage. Encourage. Where can I find that word again in the Bible? Hmm. I guess I'll just start with Genesis and just read all the way through. What are you doing, Melissa? Oh, encourage. Oh, hi, Miss Chloe. Um, I have a friend who could really use some guidance in how to live her life in a specific way. Mm -hmm. And I found this word encourage in this verse. Therefore, encourage one another and build one another up just as you are doing. First Thessalonians 5.11. 5, That's one of my favorites. I love it. And I want to find other verses that have to do with encouragement mm -hmm. because maybe those would help my friend too. But... That would mean reading through the entire Bible, <laughs> although I'm already on track to do it in a year. I think my friend could use some help now. There's a lot of pages. Well, I think I know what can help you. May I have the Bible? Yeah. Welcome to the land of the... wait for it. What? The land of the... drum roll, please. <gasps> Concordance. The what? The concordance. So the concordance helps you go on a treasure hunt and find specific words or verses in the Bible. It's kind of like a treasure map, but more words. So for instance, maybe you want to learn about the word love. You can look it up in the concordance. It will show you all the places in the Bible where love is mentioned. So let me get this straight. If I find a word and I want to read more about that topic, I can find it in the concordance. Yes, and you should know, usually the concordance is in the back of the Bible. In this Bible, it's actually combined with the dictionary. Oh, okay, so I look in the back of my Bible in the concordance, and I can see where that word is in the Bible and how many times it's in the Bible. You got it! Wow, okay, so let's try to find the word encourage. Okay. <gasps> there it is! Oh my goodness, that word is listed in one, two different places. This has saved me so much time, Miss Chloe. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, what word do you want to look up? I wonder how many times the word heart is listed in the Bible. Okay. Wow, that's way more times than encourage is listed in the Bible. I know. <laughs> cool, right? Now let's look up the word donkey. Ooh, that's <laughs> nice. Thanks for joining us. Join us next time as we share more tips on how you can read your Bible. Bye. Bye.